Governor Barber was in town today for the first meeting of the Gulf of Mexico Commission. The challenge to come up with a long-term vision for the Gulf after the Deepwater Horizon disaster. He said assemble there an impressive panel. The group of 34 includes a bank CEO, the former head of the state's largest private employer, five marine scientists, mayors from the coastal cities, and others. But it's who's not on the commission that caused a bit of an incident today. The governor talked to this impressive group for several minutes. All were volunteers, and they have a formidable challenge facing them. My goal here is to come out with a plan that is a comprehensive plan that deals with a lot of subject matter. He went on to say it will be a plan for coastal Mississippi developed by those who live and work here, including fishermen. That's when things got testy. Huge numbers of people here make their money make their livings fishing hey, or processing. Hey, have a seat at this table, Governor. Please excuse me. Well, sir, I ma'am, it's glad to I see you. I apologize, Governor, but there is not a single commercial fisherman, not a single Vietnamese person, nor a single conservationist at this table. The back and forth between Linda St. Martin, who says she's an advocate for commercial fishermen, and the governor went on for at least five minutes. The governor tried to calmly thank her and move on. It didn't work. As we can tell, sir, by your actions to date, that you have no intention whatsoever of appointing any of the fishing families, any commercial fishermen, or any conservationists to this body. This body is bogus. A few other fishermen also spoke in a much calmer manner. Afterwards, the governor told us the idea of putting a commercial fisherman on this panel is a good one. I was surprised there wasn't a commercial fisherman on there, but I, I knew we had a uh, fisherman on there, but it turns out he's a charter boat captain. So it was an oversight then? Or? Yeah, it was. And I think it's a good idea. As for the outburst during the meeting, the governor had this to say. Well, that's one of the great things about Mississippians, and most of them are polite. And when somebody's not, catches us by surprise, that's all right. It's a look, she's a citizen, she's got a right to complain. Now, Linda St. Martin said she felt one-third of the panel should be commercial fishermen. The governor said he would not agree to that. Uh, that entire five-minute confrontation between Linda St. Martin and the governor can be seen on our website now at WLOX.com.